hey guys what's up and welcome back to this channel so in this video today i'm going to be making blueberry muffins so for this recipe i'm going to be using some blueberries my all-purpose flour next i'm going to be using some sugar then i'm going to use some milk my baking powder my vegetable oil my vanilla extract my sea salt if you have regular salt you can go ahead and use it as well and then finally I'm going to be using one egg so I'm going to go ahead and get my dry ingredients ready first so you want to separate your dry ingredients from your wet ingredients so I'm going to go ahead and get my dry ingredients in one bowl so I put my flour in I'm going to go ahead and put my sugar Next, I'm going to go ahead and put my baking powder in. Then I'm going to go in with some sea salt. Now I'm getting all my wet ingredients ready. So I'm getting my vegetable oil inside of the bowl. Then I'm going to go ahead and put my egg in. So um, I forgot to put my vanilla extract inside of that, guys. Okay, so right there, you just want to mix everything together. I forgot to put my vanilla extract in, so I'm going to have to improvise right now. So I'm just pouring my uh, mixture inside of the, the flour. Then I'm going to go ahead and put my vanilla in. It's the last minute. Okay, so that's how it looks right there. So right there, I'm just putting the vanilla in. I should I should have done that before. I should pour it in with the wet ingredients, but I forgot. So now I just put the blueberries in. Then I'm getting these little cups ready. I'm going to go ahead and put my um put the mixture inside of the cups so you want to put a small portion of mixture inside of the cups because with the baking powder it's going to make your blueberries rise so you don't want to put too much inside of it So this is my second time making this recipe and I'll I actually like the recipe. It's very simple. It's not um like you don't it doesn't require lots of ingredients. So I'm doing it for the second time again. And I hope it's um you know it come out nice as the first one. So that portion amount is good to put inside of the little cups. And that's how it looks right there as you guys can see like get a better view of that now I'm just going going in with some um, sugar on top of it so you want to sprinkle lightly just sprinkle some sugar on top of it then I'm going to go ahead and insert that in the oven this bake for 15 minutes and after 15 minutes this is what it looks like it's perfect it's not dry at all so it came out pretty good I was impressed <laughs> by this recipe I will definitely make this recipe again so it's now four minutes and five seconds if you guys are still here I appreciate you guys stopping by see you guys in the next one 